Hey everyone, thanks for watching Art with Andrews, and I hope to inspire you to create. For this work I challenged myself with an elk landscape in relief on drywall. I began with selecting a piece of drywall and covered it with joint compound. All the mediums I used are really cheap and can be found at local hardware stores or home improvement stores. Once the joint compound dried, I drew the background landscape on the surface. Once the background drawing was mapped, I began applying sculpt mold to create relief, bringing the drawing to three-dimensionality. sculpt mold is a compound of plaster and paper that sets up quickly. This can be done with joint compound only, but I like to use it to create quick bulk to my relief sculpture. Here I created ridges and valleys using a rib. You can use an old plastic card, like an old gift card, for this. Once the sculpt mold has set, I covered it with joint compound. For details like trees, I used a plastic bag cut at the corner. This didn't work well, so I decided to use cake decorating tools to pipe on greater detail. Here I drew the first of the three elk to map out the sculpture. Again, I use sculpt mold to achieve bulk for relief. And once again, I covered the sculpt mold with joint compound to smooth it. I then used the cake decorating tools to pipe on antlers. I found the joint compound sticks better if I wet the background with a paintbrush first. To reinforce smaller areas, I painted white glue on the surface and let it dry. I then focused on details by carving away using an X-Acto blade.
I piped on the grass using the cake decorating end, but made sure to wet the background first. Sculptamold can be added to the top of the joint compound and sticks well. I sanded the sculpture using 100 grit sandpaper in a well-ventilated area and while wearing a mask. And I brushed away the dust using a paintbrush. Thanks for watching everyone, keep creating.